Hi everyone, how's it going? My name's Jory and I'm an editor here at Southern Living Magazine and today I'm super excited to bring you something very practical that I'm sure a lot of us are dealing with right now and that is how to remove a gel or an SNS manicure at home. So I'm sure a lot of us went and got professional manicures done before working at home and not leaving became a thing. So now we're all wondering as our manicures grow out, how do I get this stuff off safely? I'm gonna show you today, it's actually a lot easier than you would think. So um, to get started, all you'll need is a one bowl of really hot water. And this is gonna be even hotter than you could stand putting your hand into because your hand will not go directly into this. And then you will need a smaller bowl to fit inside of that bowl with the warm water. So you're gonna go ahead and put that bowl in. And this is simply to heat up the acetone that you're gonna put inside of this smaller bowl. Um, it heats it up and it keeps it warm um, and that helps the polish come off a lot quicker and a lot easier. Um, and then you're gonna go in with acetone into the small bowl. Just put in enough to where um, you could completely put your fingernails in and not leave any room for any of them sticking out. So while your acetone is in your larger bowl with the hot water, and that's heating up, you can actually go in with a nail file and just file down the first layer of polish on your nails. This is gonna help the acetone seep into your nails a lot easier and a lot quicker. So I'm sorry if you hate the sound, just go ahead and mute me. So you're just gonna kind of file them down completely every single nail until, I'll show you what it looks like, until the top layer is completely gone. So you can see it looks like that. My, you can see my nails have grown out quite a bit and they are this fire engine red. So I'm really getting sick of them. I'm very excited um, to get this off. Okay, once you file down your nails until they kind of look like this, where you can see they're super rough and you've gotten off that um, first coat of the shiny finish, you are ready to soak. So you can go ahead and put your fingers into the acetone. It's already super warm because it's been sitting in that hot water. With this one, you don't scrape it off. You'll simply take a wet paper towel to it and it should kind of come off like goo. It should be very easy and you won't ruin your nails. So I'm gonna take this bowl and head over to the TV and kind of hang out until this is ready to go. And then I will show you guys what it looks like when it is ready to come off. Hello, I just wanted to pop in and give a quick update. It's probably been about eight, nine minutes. And you can see the first layer is kind of starting to peel off already. Um, so they look really gross as of now, but just keep waiting, keep soaking, and eventually we'll get there. All right, y'all, quick update. I have moved outside just to enjoy this beautiful day. And I've been soaking for about 15 minutes now. You can see the bowl of acetones right here on my leg. I did take it out of the warm water just because my nails had gotten to a point where they didn't quite need it anymore. Um, so I'm gonna take them out for a second, dry them off, and then use a paper towel to kind of wipe down my nail and see how much comes off. Okay, we are taking my fingernails out of the bowl of acetone. I can, you can see that it's nicely worn off pretty much all of my nails at this point. Um, but I'm gonna take a paper towel to that and to kind of see what it does. Nice, so you can see a lot more of it has come off that time. So I'm just gonna keep repeating this process until everything is gone. All right, y'all, that's it, easy peasy. So I finished the process of soaking and wiping them off with a paper towel and as you can see, they're looking good and polish free. So I'm gonna go give myself a manicure to make sure I'm taking care of my nails. But other than that, thank you so much for watching. Give us a thumbs up on YouTube and leave a comment below to let me know how this process works for you. Thanks so much guys, bye.